Hey everyone and welcome back to Mad Investor. As you know, I like to cover a lot of, you know, projects and stuff like that, but I also talked a bit about the cards. And this time I would like to review a Reef card. So I was lucky enough to actually get, in a way, a beta testing and the pre-roll of that card. So uh, actually it arrived to me. So I actually got it and you can actually see that um, the card. And this is something which is pretty cool because what the card actually allows you to do, it allows you to spend crypto uh, in, uh, you know, just stores and whatever places you're doing shopping or transaction with drawing money with, uh, I would say, minimum fees, which is pretty cool. And when you look at their, you know, website, you can see that, uh, you know, it's coming, your freedom or crypto, you know, seamless in transaction with digital assets and access to over 40 million global brands and services world worldwide. So what I see that they partnered with the Optimus uh, Card UK Limited, which is a provider for cards in uh, UK. And I can see that there will be two different options for you to... Um, of the card so actually you will have the euro option and the gbp and when it comes to the card itself uh, i actually logged into my account and this is the uh, kind of a beta option and i've ordered my card so when you look at the card itself there are a few things which you need to know uh, which are actually the fees of the card but before i tell you about it uh, let me just tell you some of the functions of it so when you look at the card, it's a, you know, a normal plastic card which you can use it holding your wallet and use it on a daily basis and spend in store, restaurant, etc. But um, what kind of um, uh, crypto you can use? So when you go to accounts, you'll see that you can use um, Ethereum, Litecoin, Bitcoin and Reef. So these are the current coins which uh, you can uh, use. When you press manage accounts, you'll see that I can also add the BXX. So these are the, the, the main one. But on top of it, you also have the stable coins. So when you look at the stable coins, you have the GBP, Euro, uh, Euro T and USDT. So these are the four coins which you can use. Um, the only thing which with, for example, USDT, uh, you need to see that this is the um, ERC20. So you need to be aware of that when you're looking at sending the money. So, um, you know, this is pretty cool as obviously when you start using the card, uh, I think the best option is to send either the Reef or LTC as you know, LTC is uh, the, the cheapest way to send it and probably the same with uh, Reef. So, um, you know, both of those you can use. Obviously, if you're a Bitcoin holder, Ethereum, you want to send some more money. Yeah, it's also good. You just need to press add funds and then we'll show you your, um, your wallets. And you can also send out from your wallet the uh, amount of money. There is also an option to top up the account. So when you can, you can actually press add funds and for example, choose, um, let's say GBP and you can use the bank transfer or a payment card. So this is also the way to um, top up that card. But obviously if you are, you know, a crypto and you want to use your crypto, this is probably the way to do that. So um, about the fees of the card, because that's probably what you're wondering about. If you go to the Reef card and actually look at the um, card information, GBP, it's similar in euros. Uh, to order a card, it costs you a 10 pounds. So this is the initial fee you need to pay if you want to have a card when it will be available to the general public. But uh, what happens is that you also pay a small fee every time you spend a bit of money. So um, I can see most of the cards like Crypto.com or um, you know some others which I've used in the past have a similar kind of fee. So we can see that um, the reef went for 2% of the transaction value and uh, with every transaction. So that means you can pay with um, like if I would have, let's say it in GBP, if I would pay in the foreign currency is the same thing. So, you know, the money is exactly the same. When it comes to cash withdrawals in pounds in UK, it's 250 per withdrawal and cash withdrawal in foreign, foreign currency outside of UK, it's three pounds plus 1.5% of the transaction value. So it's not bad comparing to some of the others like crypto.com, Trustra, etc. So, you know, it's, I think, pretty decent. When you look at the euro and you can see card fee information in euros, you can see it's similar, 10% value, but withdrawal, it's 2.99 in euros and outside of euro uh, option, it's 3.55 plus 1.5%. So I think it's decent, especially for, you know, everyone who is looking for spending their crypto in an easy matter. And for example, in UK, you don't have that many options. Some countries, you know, don't have the uh, main cards which you can use, but I, I always believe it's good to have more options. That's why I always look at as many cards as possible. So it's really easy to spend those crypto 
in store. So uh, this is just an overview of the cards. I think it's, you know, it's pretty cool. I can see, you know, expire of the card that's um, until 25. So, yeah, you know, I have the card for the next three years, which is uh, decent. You just need to easily top it up with um, either, you know, some euros or GBP or just send some crypto to it so you can actually um, use it. I think that the Reef is doing a lot of cool things. And uh, also I'll give you a video uh, separate when the card is live and available to the general public. So you can also order it and you know i'll show you the process how to order a card and how to follow through so it might you know come to you um and when i saw within the delivery date within uk and europe which is eea it's within 10 days so it's also pretty decent well, I hope that you enjoyed that short view as you know i like to uh, cover some of the uh, topics some of the you know a new project and also Reef, it's a well-established uh, coin as you know, we can see that it, they're developing a lot of things when you actually look at their website, which is pretty cool. So, you know, I think with that, you got some uh, nice knowledge. And if you like this video, you know what to do. Just leave a like and subscribe and well, see you in the next video. Take care.